What's up, folks? How y'all doing? I'm going to tell y'all what this shit is really all about. Big on. Welcome to the Big On Show. I'm going to tell you just like this, right? My theory, just my theory, is that this coronavirus was invented by the Chinese. All right, they say, oh, yeah, yeah, it came from China, Chinese or Wuhan, right? Say, so come from Wuhan, right? Well, the what's that? Yeah, they had a biological chemi chemical or uh, shop lab right down the block, right? So what that means is the guy uh, from the lab went and visit the seafood place over there, and he carried the uh, the virus with him, and that's where it originated. It, it attached it to food and to live animals. And that's when the virus started. But it originally came from the biological lab down the block. So what I'm saying is that everything is made in China. This, this, this story is called Made in China. This is for all you sisters and all you materialistic people that like the Louis and the Gucci and the pocketbooks. You want the real stuff. I, I used to, I sold bootleg stuff. I sold Fake sneakers, fake clothes, whatever, man. Boy, if you call it, y'all say it's fake. To me, the shit is the same shit. A lot of that shit is just the same shit that, that goes in the store. You know? A lot of that is the same stuff that, that that's a lot of the stuff is the same thing that uh actually is uh that that's invented, you know? Oh, I don't want no fake Louis bag, I don't want no fake sneakers, I want the real thing. Like I told y'all, everything is made in China. Everything made in China. Now look at this shit. Them niggas, they so fucking souped up on the products that they make because they make everything. You go, you go get on, you put on some drawers. Made in China. You go buy a portable pussy. Made in China. I don't give a fuck what you buy, man. I mean, made in China. Some of that stuff that y'all get that says oh, made in Italy and all of that shit. Italy bought it from, had the people in China make it. So it still was made in China. And all you dumb motherfucking, I don't want to call no names, motherfuckers that say this is real and that's fake. And, oh, this is made in Italy. This is made in France, motherfucker. Made in China. All right. Now, just like they made the coronavirus. Duke Kung Kent, whatever his name is, the president of China, that evil guy that said that he was going to set New York and the United States up in a ball of fire. Well, here it is, folks. Here it is, folks. Tell him, Johnny. Yes, it is, brother. Yes, it is. In a ball of fire. A ball. So, so okay, now, a ball of fire. Wow. And so, you, you got to remember... They just now started testing us out here, and it's thousands and thousands and thousands of cases. You know what that means? And even in Ohio got hundreds of thousands of cases. How the fuck they get that many cases so quick? You know why? Because they already raised war on America. They already put that shit out here. But it backfired, man. Don't you get it? It fucking backfired, man. The guy... Chemical, the shit was so strong that it, you know, it was on his clothes or wherever the fuck it was on his ass. I don't give a fuck where it was at, but he visited that animal place with them snakes and them bats, and that's where the shit all started at. Mm -hmm. They say a snake or a bat. They're a little confused. Me personally, I believe it was a snake. Yeah. I snakes are some slimy, greasy motherfuckers, right? Snakes got venom. I always believed America should have just killed all the motherfucking snakes, man. Give somebody, every snake you catch, I, I believe they should put out a law. Every fucking venom or snake you get, we'll give you a dollar a snake. Like fucking, like they do with the cans and shit. One dollar a snake. Find them motherfuckers, hunt them down, and kill them. Because if you don't kill them, they gonna kill you. You know what I mean? You see how you already see the statistics on how many fucking snakes that's killing people out here. 
snakes, man, kill motherfuckers. They said, but the white people said, oh, that's my pet. You know, you can't kill a snake. That's against the law. That's the law. Those are those are the nature of pets. Just like the fucking dinosaurs. Kill a motherfucking snakes, man. They kill a lot of people. What the fuck you gonna do with them? But look, with the Chinese guys, they wanna go eat the motherfuckers. They wanna fucking eat everything under the fucking moon. Grasshoppers, snakes, bats. Okay, a bat? Bat, well, bat is an ugly motherfucker, so chances are that shit gotta infect you with disease too. So, so what the Chinese did, they combined a bat and a snake and, you know, they used, the, you know, the chemicals to mix it up together, you know, and, and, and eventually somehow they, 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 they figured out a way to create a biological weapon against America. They got tired of motherfucking redneck motherfuckers like Donald Trump. They got tired of them motherfuckers. Always discriminating and. And trying to take over every motherfucking thing and want to be superior and shit. Support the fucking Ku Klux Klans and all them other silly motherfuckers that's wearing costumes and shit. <laughs> Talk about, I don't like a black guy. You know? Okay. What about a Chinese motherfucker? They don't like, they ain't like a black motherfucker and a white motherfucker. And they invented this fucking weapon right here that's raising destruction. All across America, yeah. ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Made in China. Yeah. Remember that coat? It was all made in China, baby. Yeah, yeah. And I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to tell you. It was made in China, man. That's where this shit came from. Why you think the Chinese government chastised that guy, silenced him, wanted to lock him the fuck up, kill him, whatever they wanted to do to him? Because he was telling the secret. They didn't want nobody to know about where this shit have came from, man. You know, I mean, he pretty much blew the whistle. He's pretty much, you can consider the traitor as well. That's why they was, they didn't want nobody to motherfucking know about it. You know, and that's why they hid it for months or how long they had this shit. They lied about it. And the man died. But he died a hero. That Chinese guy, see, it's always good in all people. We know we got a bunch of motherfucking cocksucking White motherfuckers, black motherfuckers, yellow motherfuckers, and green motherfuckers, man. That almighty dollar, man, I, I got the chance to feel a lot of that. But what I'm trying to tell you is China, made in China, them motherfuckers is the ones that invented that disease. They, it, it didn't come from them from eating. It, it was a biological attack. They already put that shit over here. That's why we got way more cases than them, really. Once we continue to, to test it, you're going to prove it that we got way more cases than them. Mm. I got old fucking friends I grew up with is mysteriously dying. Nobody know where the fuck is coming from. All the young white doctors and, and all of these fucking petitioners they got out here, they don't know shit because everything made in China. China's the guys that invent every fucking thing. We got our foot up our ass and don't vent shit. Well, you know, some things, but it was made in China. And and that's what this shit is all about, man. They want us to believe that somebody ate a bad animal over there and, and that's how that shit was evolved. No, the guy across the street at the biological lab came over on that side and it, it is all connected. And, and they, he it backfired. See, when you were to evil, when you're an evil person and you're an evil man, you know, God always, you know, uh, you know, the good, he going to make sure the good always come out better in the long run, you know, and that's why the shit backfired. The evil is going to backfire. But nobody gets away with evil. If you're going around killing people, hurting people, black on black violence, all that shit you're doing to people or your own or whoever you're doing shit to. I don't give a fuck who, what color they is. You're wrong, man, and it's going to backfire. And that's what happened with Duku Kim. I don't even know how to fucking say his name, man. I, I didn't. I, I was. You know, I, if I didn't write a book, I'd be computer literary. I wouldn't even be able to be talking to you guys and and dealing with social media. Thank God that I, you know, and God love that I actually wrote a book, two books. Mike Tyson tried to kill my daddy and the liquor store blues. So I was able to educate myself and basically by writing my books, it, it, it made me uh, re-educate myself and go back. 
uh, back to school for two, three years. And and, 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 and and that's how I learned how to use the computer. It's millions of black people right now still very illiterate, don't know how to use a computer. You know, and you know, and, and that's the problem in there. But when you really study the scientific thing, like I say, made in China. Every fucking thing has been made in China. And I believe it. And Luke, Luke Kim, whoever, they might want to come get me or whatever they want to do. I ain't afraid, man, because we fucked up, man. We, yo, listen, you give or take three months with all these illiterate motherfuckers running around and we not listening. Look how China contained, they actually contained the virus, man. They haven't had a fucking case in a week. They fucking, the person that, if they, because they invented it, so they learned how to maneuver it and control it because they're a dictatorship. We over here, man, we, we, you know, we fucking out in the opening. We don't give a fuck. We don't, we lawless. We just a lawless country. So it's going to be much harder for us to contain this virus. So we, we, we is really fucked up. This might be the last time y'all see me. I had a good life, man. I got some beautiful kids, man. I don't want to see, I don't, I want to, if I have to go, I'd rather go first. I don't want to see my kids and nothing, suffer nothing, man. I, you know, if, go, if they going to take us, man, you take me first, man. You know, but I want to tell Donald Trump and the rest of those dudes, man, they might have to just raise war, man. You know, if we going to go out, and they're going to just fucking take us out like this, man. And they want to try to just rule the whole world. You know, that's their plan, to rule the world. They're going to kill us off and rule the fucking world. We might as well go to fucking war, man. We might as well go down swinging. Like I did when I fought Butterbean. When I had to whip Butterbean ass, we had to go down swinging, baby. So made in China. It's made in China. I don't give a fuck whether it's Gucci Prada, Louis Vuitton, to all you motherfucking bitches out there, is all fake shit. It's all made in China. Just like this shit. And they didn't want him to blow the whistle. And that's what the fuck this shit is all about. We got more cases than in China. Because it was over here first. It just backfired. Made in China, ladies and gentlemen. The country is at war, and God bless America, and I hope Trump can make America great again, made in China.